Vegas, the ace of Vegas. And welcome back to Ace of Vegas by Spinners and Sharks. Ace is here, and today we are going to play yet another bet rock game. Uh, so let's yebe debe do this. I think we're going to go ahead and put 60 million uh, through the machine over here just on the merit. The, actually, you know what? Let's jack it up a little bit. Bet rock's either really, really good for you or it's really, really bad for you. We're going to put 120 million chips on the table because I'm feeling pretty nuts. So and put it through a hundred spins. So let's go ahead and see how we do. On your mark, get set, ready, and go. Awesome. Think about Bet Rock though, um, it's kind of a quiet game most of the time. I mean, it still makes sounds and all that good stuff, but it's really just about the wilds. You either get some astonishing wild spins or you don't. You either get some really great free spins or you don't. Um, and this is probably like the fourth Bet Rock game. I think it was probably one of the more popular ones in my Vegas slots just because it's uh, it's one where you can actually pick up a lot of extra chips and keep people going. It really gets the adrenaline pumping, uh, pumps it full of dopamine just because you see that. Also, it's got a nice little familiar property for everybody. The Flintstones, or at least a thinly varied, <coughs> excuse me, thinly veiled parody of it. Sorry, allergies are really kind of kicking up around here. Cottonwood trees started blooming here in Denver, and they are real. Oh, there we go. We got some free spins. You yeah, boy! Or should I say, yabba dabba do? Okay. So we're going to go ahead and just start adding stacks of wilds. And what I do like about Bet Rock, though, is if you get some lousy first uh, first round spins, usually when you're down to two or three spins, it'll give you something ginormous that's just loaded with uh, wilds there. So now that we're getting down to it. Okay, that was a bigger win. We probably won't get a really big win, but we'll get a, hopefully get a decent one on the way out. So we're down to the last two, two spins here. That one wasn't too bad. I don't know why I didn't win that one. And don't really understand why I won that one. Oh, there we go, there we go. Boom! 37 million. All right. So that was a total of 46 million. We're about a third of the way through the spins that we need to, or through the chips that we need to make a profit here. And I feel like there's a dice game. Too. Oh yeah, there it is, the dice bonus. So hopefully we get that, because it just has you roll craps or something like that. I can't remember exactly how it works. I've only played it on the large scale My Vegas PC game before, so hopefully we'll get to see that as well. This has really got me thinking that I have to do that video where I learn how to read slot reels, because I don't always fully understand why I win some hands here, or some spins, and in other ones, it's like, yeah, that looks like it's a win, but it's not. Sorry, Ace. Um, if you guys know how to read uh, slot reels, let me know in the comment section down below. I'd gladly put you on an episode. We'll go ahead and do a Skype call, and then you can go ahead and break it down for me. I will go ahead and get some clips there, and if you're a YouTuber, I will go ahead and link you. Uh, I'll, I'll go ahead and link you down there so that you can get some great traffic back to your channel too. And who knows, maybe we can do some more collabs in the future. But I'd love for someone to teach me how to read slot reels. I don't fully understand. I know it's kind of like video poker, and it's a comp complicated RGN video poker and all that, I just don't quite get it. It's not like a card game. But anyway, though, enough babbling about that. Um, let's also talk about the podcast a little bit, too. So we're going to go ahead and do another one, June 30th. So that's going to be a good one. I think 9 p.m. Eastern Time is definitely going to be our, uh, our stand by. I'll let you guys know if something changes here. Oh, there's a good one. Boom. Yeah, Bet Rock's always a great game, and it's got a it, it's got a great property that it parodies there to the Flintstones. Everybody knows the Flintstones, even if you don't know the Flintstones, you know the theme song when it gets revving up. So that's always fun. Um, I remember Halle Berry was actually in one of the movies there. I think it was one of her early roles there before she was famous. Famous. <laughs> it was just some that I'm sure she did for the exposure and for the paycheck and all that. So there's that. I think John Goodman was in it, with it in it too. So. <laughs> I can't remember exactly. I really like to get this dice bonus game rolling here. But anyway, though, don't forget to tune into the hashtag Vegas podcast. We're starting to do those every Sunday now at 9 p.m. Eastern Time, 6 p.m. Pacific Time, and that is live with my crew, the Comp Sky and Chris Rocks, two other Vegas tubers I like to hang out with, and they do lots of fun things too, like uh, 
cops guy, he likes to do the card videos, like he'll tell you how to get status matches and things like that, as well as do some gameplay and teach you different strategies on how to play uh, My Vegas Slots. Uh, Chris also likes to do some gameplay strategies and hotel reviews and all that. She'll also teach you how to dress. She's quite the fashionista. Show you where to get all the hot threads and the good makeup before you go to Vegas. So if you're ever curious about that, those are the guys I like to hang out with. You should hang out with them too. All right. Oh, also, we gotta congratulate the comps guy. He just rolled over his first hundred subscribers and got his custom URL, so big shout-outs to him there. We talked about it a little bit on the podcast this Sunday, too, so don't forget about that. All right, and guys, we're about uh, 75% of the way through the spins here, or getting pretty close to it. Still haven't seen that dice bonus yet. Think about Bet Rock. You either, you either do incredibly well or it's just a really stagnant, stale game. So the free spins are really the. Uh, I don't know what happens if you get a free spins and a dice bonus on the same reel. I'm not sure if the game does that. It'd be fascinating if it did, and it keeps threatening us with a good time here. Stop threatening me with a good time, game. Man, it's a total coin cues right here like to have a good time on this game. I don't know. Bet Rock hits you hard, so you either win or you don't. I think this is one of the better ones to just play as a short-term game compared to a long-term game, so I always play these pretty short-term. Last 20 spins here. Hoping that we get that dice bonus, because i really like to show you guys the dice bonus there. Um, it got me thinking about another game that My Vegas needs to make. They need to make a My Vegas craps game. And I don't know why Play Studios hasn't capitalized on that. Maybe pass line bets, or, or you know, they could make it like pop slots where you actually play with other people, and then you decide how you want to bet. Like you can pet, bet against them, or you can do the don't pass, or you can do the pass, and maybe you get a special bonus for betting with the pass line, or something like that. Um, then you could uh, get fun little balloons, because craps you actually do have to pay attention to. So it's not one that you just play in the background. Oh, there we go. We got another free spin bonus. All right, spinners and sharks, let's spin to win. Okay. And let's get some of these wilds stacked up over here. See, some of these pop in, and I have no idea why I don't win them. Like, that one I won, but the one before that I didn't. And I'd very much like to learn why. So hopefully, if we get, like, a 10 million chip uh, drop-off over there, I'd go through the roof. Because then we just about break even. If we can get a big one on this next one here, because they just say, they say they add 20 spins on each wheel, or 20 wilds on each wheel, but who, who knows how many they really add. Two point four, and this is our last spin here. Let's get a big one. Yeah, buddy. All right, all right. All right, we got only got 10 spins to go. Let's go ahead and get these last spins. All right, 10. All right. So we'll go ahead and wrap this game up over here. Hopefully we'll find a little something else. Maybe we'll get lucky and get that dice bonus. I think we've had that happen one time where we got a bonus at the very last second there. I don't think it's going to happen this time. Maybe. Is it going to threaten us with a good time? Oh, it threatened us with a good time. That's sad. That's sad. Maybe we'll get one more good one. Last spin. Let's go. Come on, where's that good time? Yabba dabba do time. Oh, well, we did not have a gay old time. That was a rather, uh, that was a rather bland time at the end over there. But we did pretty good. We got some good free spins. So I'm gonna go ahead and do some quick maths over here, and we'll uh, count up the booty. Okay, guys, and we are back. So it looks like they got us uh, paid back in pebbles over here on Bet Rock. It was really, really big pebbles, but not a lot of pebbles on this one. We had a payback percentage of 96.04%, so it's almost good enough for our best games in My Vegas. Honestly, if you want to play this, I don't think it's a bad selection. Um, if you're not getting a, uh, a free spins bonus for a while, I probably wouldn't invest a lot of time in it. But it's a fun game. It moves by itself. It's pretty fast-paced, and it looks nice, so I don't mind it so much. Otherwise, if you're looking for a really good payback percentage or looking to make a profit so that you're going to have a big day tomorrow, yabba dabba, don't play this game. Well, in the meantime, though, Ace of Vegas is going to go ahead and sign out. I'm going to wish you guys strong hands, happy spinning, and then we will move back down the page over here. I think we are up to 
yellow brick reels and frisky fortunes around the world. We're getting pretty close to the end of the game over here with only about, uh, it looks like about four more levels, or four more worlds to go here. I'm treating it like a Mario game. There's only four more worlds to go, guys. We only have, I don't know, like 11, what's this, 19? Oh, no, we got we, we got plenty of episodes left. We're going to have plenty of episodes here. We're going to be doing the best slots in my Vegas slots for quite some time, and we'll have lots of fun things to do. But till next time, friends, Ace of Vegas is signing out.